Okay. Oh, I guess we're gonna we're coming back here now. It's picking up speed. All right. And see, this is one thing I found out here. I don't know if you can hear it, but if you tweak it just right. Okay, we're getting up now. Now we're putting out from the uh, little coil here, we're putting out 4.3, 4. You can see it's climbing. But let's not forget now, we are charging the battery. Now we're up to 12.78. So we are charging the battery as the Bedini had advertised. Uh, we're charging the Bedini. We're charging the uh, battery. But we're also putting out power over here. Oh, got to tweak it a little better than that. All right, now I have uh, discriminately uh, just put on there. I'm until I get it up around 4.5. I'm not going to throw the load on here, but I'm going to stick a load of four of these off stable multi vibrators. I'm going to stick that load on this Bedini motor here that is successfully charging over there charging that battery okay oop down wrong way gotta tweak it and this is I found I put this here just to tweak it up here okay we're at 4.6 I'm ready to put a load on here so now what I'm going to do we're at 4.7 volts now remember these batteries over here kind of died on me We've only got 0.87 volts on these crystal batteries, which are trying to run, which unsuccessfully run all these. Now, watch when I put the load onto the Bedini. We would expect everything to go down, put a load on it, slow it down, but no, watch this. Look, the voltage is going up. We're still charging the battery, and we have one, two, see the lights are blinking, three, and four. The meter here, we're showing four point, well, you see it fluctuates up and down, and this is the, the voltage on the crystal cell batteries. Uh, I would go over and show you the, the amperage, but when I hit the amperage things start happening, so I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to bypass that. It's just amazing to see this. And as you can see, she's a still running, and we're still getting the power out here, right there. I'm not making any conclusion. I'm not making any claims, but hey, looks pretty fine to me. It has some very good potential as far as I'm concerned. We're still charging the battery here. Still charging. Okay, it's still running. Remember, I believed that the key to all of this is that both coils, whether it be the coil there from the Bedini or the coil here, are both magnetite core. I believe that the lens effect on it has really been cut down, allowing it to do things that you wouldn't believe. There we go. And of course the lights are still blinking. Okay. And as you see, power on the crystal cells fluctuating from this oscillating current that's coming from that Bedini motor. Okay, folks, like I said, draw your own conclusions, do what you will, but I'm very happy with this. Uh, peace to all of you.